it's currently what time is it? Yeah, you can stretch. She's here, guys. Oh. 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 Coronavirus is literally scaring everyone. Like this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. So yeah, this honestly just kind of sucks. It really does. It is a beautiful Sunday morning and we're starting off this weekly vlog in my apartment as usual. I'm not gonna work out this morning just because I just, I, to be completely honest, your girl doesn't have the energy. So I'm gonna do it after like lunch, but before dinner like I did the other day. But currently today we've just got a lot of organizational things to do, such as just getting ready before Carson moves in on Tuesday. And I've also got an audition tomorrow and I've also got another, um, I don't know how to explain it. It's like a research thing that was done on me a while ago, but they're doing a follow-up type thing and they're doing it tomorrow as well. So I'm gonna have people in my house. I just need to get some things together as well as editing. So I've already rough cutted one. All I need to do is just add all the little details and things like that and then export it to YouTube. And then the other one I have to actually just do everything with. So we're getting a lot of things done today and that's the tea. So yeah, just come along with me to my kitchen. That's what we always seem to be doing, so. Yeah. So my mom actually bought some things from Costco and shipped them out to me via Instacart. They don't have my rice and I'm actually really angry about that. That sucks. I'm gonna make some oatmeal. I'm upset that I bought this kind of oatmeal when I went to Costco last with my father. This stuff is so big and thick, like it just doesn't, it doesn't cook as fast. guys it is currently 2 20 and my mom told me to start watching this show called aquafina is nora from queens i've been seeing so many like uh ads for it and stuff so i was like sure why not let's just watch it and they were really short episodes as well so they were like 30 minute episodes and it's funny this vlog is literally 38 minutes long right now i don't like how long it is but it just kind of happened i didn't realize that i vlogged that much when i was daily vlogging i wouldn't get enough content so the vlogs would be shorter but for this it's like i didn't realize that i weekly vlogged so much yeah this is gonna be another whole rough cut situation i'm gonna go ahead and rough cut it one more time and then add titles and stuff and it should be done okay I just hit my hand really hard lunch is here finished lunch did a little TikTok sesh and now we're gonna get back mm-hmm mm -hmm. It is currently exactly 6 o'clock p.m. on the dot. My video is now in the process of uploading. We're gonna shoot for 8.30, but YouTube always like, is YouTube. And guys, it's 6 o'clock and the sun isn't down. <sighs> Gotta love daylight spring forward. All right, I'm tired, I'm gonna go. Day I am so exhausted. My camera cut off while I was recording the workout for my video, but I'm done working out. I'm literally shaking. My legs are like shaking. I'm so tired. It is currently 9.02 p.m. I took out some cookie dough to defrost and then I realized I was like, I've got an audition tomorrow. I kind of should go to bed early and like it's gonna be hard to go to bed early because of the time change. That was a fail. Good morning guys. It is like 6.30. I'm just going to stretch a little bit and then I'm going to like make up my bed and then get ready. So yeah. Now makeup time. Makeup is done. She's, the eyelash glue on this one is still drying so. 
I have like certain shirts that I wear for auditions and this is one of them. Today is going to be so warm here in New York City. I think the low is literally like 40 something and then the high is like 60 something. So like we're getting there guys. Before I ended the vlog last night, I made some overnight oatmeal. It is 7.20 so I'm gonna eat this bowl really fast and head out by 7.30. Hey. Hey. Hi. Hi. Introduce yourself. My name is Sarah Rose. I'm a dancer and a fellow auditioner. Yes, Slate. Come on, Slate. Well, we met an audition like a month ago. Was that a month ago? That was about a month ago. Eight months ago in my head. Uh, really? New York, no, New York time is just like That's this. so true. Like, it literally just goes, literally so, just fast. goes so fast. Like, I never like vlog in audition rooms or holding rooms just because I feel like whenever I don't have friends, I'm this like, I'm not a good audition room to vlog. Yeah, no, there's no, no, there's one, no here. one here, this which is happens. great. Like, it's basically empty. Say hi. It's never happened. But yeah, so it, this never happens. Downstairs, oh, it's, it's a whole other story. So, but oh, it's crazy. it feels good. We can breathe in this room. It is currently you can what stretch. Time is yeah, you can stretch. It is 8 30, so Ooh, it's early. that's good. It starts at 10, so we're just like, oh, we're just gonna God, vibe so out, you know? And then so that's it. I could have came like way later and still been seen, and that's just what makes me mad. And that's she's literally number one. Like, literally. I Literally number one. No one signed up. And, and you got like, here at what time? 645. Like 645. And there was one here. And I was like, cool, this is weird. But yeah, that's the vlog update. That's we'll, the vlog update. <laughs> we'll go ahead and on March 9th, 2020. Yes. <laughs> it's slightly more crowded. Here, I'll do a little. Yeah. Still kind of empty, honestly. It's not bad. Really good. Let me see. It is currently 9:18, so we still got like 45 still ish minutes. One. <laughs> still number one. I'm number 65. So <laughs> 69. 65. <laughs> We're done. Yay! She's gonna get to work, so and so glad to introduce her in the vlog. She's such a fun lady. But yeah, you guys will probably see her very soon in other vlogs. But I'm gonna get lunch. All right, so I have a call back at three. So I'm at. I'll just show you the bag of where I'm at. I haven't been here in like three months, so I'm kind of proud of myself. Back at the audition room. It's literally empty now. It's literally like nobody here. Um, I'm gonna just read. That's all I can do. Let me see. I don't even know what time it is. I just put my phone over there to charge. Literally haven't gotten Starbucks in forever, so here we are. So guys, I got cut. I think we all know that now, but I got cut. I'm heading home. I treated myself before with Chino. I'm not that bad. It's all good. It's been a day for sure. Is this playing? Yes, it's been a day for sure, but it's all good. It was actually really fun. It was a good audition, but yeah. Can we talk about how it's literally 70 degrees outside of New York? I have a jacket on just because I'm cold from the audition, but like, it is 70 degrees outside in New York City. I am fathom, like, hi. It's been here for a while. So recap of today's audition, it actually went super well. I'm 99.9% .9 positive that they cut me because of my age. I put it on my sheet that I turned 18 on the 27th, but they literally was like, we're just looking for something specific, whether that's height, weight, and like some of you guys, or he said something about like, oh, maturity and this and that. We just don't know whether or not if like a younger cast member would like fit with like whatever. And I was like, I was so mad. The reason why I think that is because the guy, one of the guys actually like, I said, thank you. Like on the way of walking out, like after being cut and he was like, thank you so much Jada like he literally like knew my name and I was like oh so you like took the time to look at my headshot and resume you know so that happened but it's okay I feel good like about that audition so because I know it wasn't like me big jam beret pork cutlets and chim chim chimichurri bar okay these um so tonight I really want to have fettuccine alfredo again. It's gonna be so bad, but I don't care. Like it's gonna be amazing. Like my body's gonna love it. I have an audition tomorrow. That's the plan for tomorrow. I also have an audition the following day. I'm pretty sure, and then the following day, and then the following day. So I have auditions every single day this week that I'm attending. So it's a jam-packed week, and I'm glad you guys could come along. Also, my hair is frizzing up so bad, guys. Literally, I have my AC on. It is 70 degrees outside. 70. Turns out I'm gonna make dinner now because I forgot that the interview thing is literally gonna take three hours. So if I don't eat dinner now, I'm gonna be so, so, so hungry. So I'm gonna make some dinner. Yay! I make this the best. Like I, I don't know. I just do it so easily, you know? Oh, it's steam, it's hot. Okay guys, they are currently here and they want to get some outside shots before the sun goes down, so I'm gonna head outside and not bring my camera. So yeah, bye! 
Hi guys, it is 10 18 p.m. They have been left. I watched the rest of The Bachelor. My hair, what, uh, this is what happens when you lie down. So they left. It was such a good and productive session. I took off my lashes, obviously, because I'm bald on my eyes. I'm just gonna take the night to chill and get ready for tomorrow's audition. Tomorrow my audition is at 10, so I can wake up at like seven or eight and still be fine, which is great. Carson gets in tomorrow as well, so a lot of eventful things happening and Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna shower and I'm going to chill out. Good morning, literally, it's 12 19 in the morning. But anyway, I'm setting up for my audition. I think I'm gonna wake up at like eight. I'm gonna check the details of my audition one last time just so I can make sure that I have everything. It's best to do this the night before so that you're just not stressing out in the morning. It is almost 12 30 and I'm heading to bed. So I think I have everything prepared for tomorrow. So yeah, good night and I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Good morning guys, it's Tuesday and it is currently 8.08 and I'm about to head out for my audition at 9. Carson already texted me this morning saying that she is going to the airport. This morning I got so many just weird updates about coronavirus and now it's starting to get slightly scary, not gonna lie, but at the same time I'm not gonna let that change what I'm doing, like I'm just gonna clean better like not touch my face as i was putting on moisturizer this is the regular stuff that like you wouldn't do you know and i feel like that should be fine like i'm not gonna stress out about it and change my entire daily routine to avoid coronavirus like it just doesn't make sense i'm not wearing lashes today i just i i can't officially outfit ready i told you i literally wear like one out of three outfits it's just the same thing you know so this is another audition outfit and i'm going to be heading out right now coronavirus is literally scaring everyone like carson literally texted me saying oh there's like literally nobody on my plane and i was like yeah that's also why plane tickets are so cheap and like i think the stock market is just like literally crashing like there's just like so many things happening right now and like it's crazy because it doesn't feel real like in my reality you know but then i forget that like it's for real and so i'm about to go on the subway so really important to wash my hands sanitize all that stuff psa to all of you guys out there too to do the same um yeah this is like no joke even though i'm like i'm honestly not stressed about it like i can tell why people would be stressed about it but i'm not stressed at all there's no reason to be they said that if you drink water you prevent the virus from staying in your throat and what it'll do is wash it down and once it washes it down your stomach acid will break it up so stay hydrated stay hydrated stay hydrated so yes i'm gonna head out and uh, coronavirus uh, update over hey guys so i'm with abby introduce yourself hi i'm abby and <laughs> that's it um, we just got a call back, so yay! Go team! <laughs> Woo! So we're gonna head back at 12.15. We're currently eating sandwiches and salads. Man, that's all that's going on right now. Audition went well. We did a little cute across the floor combination. Lots of picks. Yeah, lots of bop moms and smacking your face and yeah. pop. So, yeah, it was fun. And now we're gonna continue eating our lunch and we'll be back for the call back later. Bye. <laughs> Okay guys, it is currently 2.10. We just went in for the callback. We did a contemporary piece and we did another across the floor type piece and I got another callback. So we gotta stay till 2.30 in order to sing. It is currently 2.11. 11. And I'm gonna sing and then hopefully I'm done. I feel so bad. Carson's been at my place like in the area for so long and she can't get in because I'm here. So yeah, the day she's here, I get called back twice. Guys, we made it past two cuts. What a day, what a day, yay. Now I have to sing. Yeah, and that's every dancer's like best dream. Wanna say hi, hello. Yeah, so callback vibes. We're currently all going over music that we semi know. <laughs> so yeah, that's the update, bye bye. They're starting to paint this mural on this building and this morning only the top part was done and now it's the whole thing. So tomorrow I'll come back to see how much they've done. So it's windy, slightly windy, but I got called back for tomorrow, yay! So I have to be back oh, at two tomorrow. I'm really excited. It's like slightly raining, I don't like it. All right guys, I'm back home in my apartment with a new being here. One moment. <laughs> One moment. I walked back to my apartment and totally forgot to vlog because we were unpacking her stuff as well as just getting some stuff together. She's here, guys! And we're gonna go to Shake Shack because- I've never been. She's never been and I don't know how she's not been. Yeah. There's there's Shake Shacks in Charlotte, they open too. So I I'm usually like, go to Steak and Shake. Is that like the same? No. <laughs> Shake Shack, first Shake Shack. You have to try it on camera, you have to. 
<laughs> hey guys, we're at Peace Food Cafe and we've got another friend. <laughs> yes. <laughs> She hasn't been in the vlog in a hot second, so let her warm up to the camera. Here, maybe look at yourself. I'll put the viewfinder That's up. That's so much work. <laughs> but yes, this place is so cute. Like, look at it. The lighting. Oh, the lighting's just over. There we go. Today, I didn't work out as well. I didn't do my, like, sit-ups and abs, and I didn't, I didn't do my, like, ab and butt workout just because I had an audition, and it was all day. I did a lot of walking, though, and I did a lot of, like, moving and fitness and activeness. Yeah, today was another day of not doing it. She's watching The Bachelor, and I'm not. And she's cracking up, and I'm not. <laughs> I'm... <laughs> yeah, please don't say anything, because she's about to spoil it for me, and I, it's literally the finale okay, finale. Okay. What? All right, guys, so The Bachelor just finished, and I didn't watch it, so I'm staying off of social media so that I don't watch it. But now, I think we're getting kind of hungry. Like, by we, I mean, I'm going to go crazy. It's literally 10.45, but we're making cinnamon rolls. Yeah, you, do you want to make them? <laughs> no, it is. Oh, okay. We need any more of these instructions? Mm -hmm. Wait. Honestly? Yeah, I was about to just, no, that was the wrong angle. Oh, <laughs> oh my God. Oh, it's just to peel this first. I thought we had already peeled it. There we go. <laughs> oh my god! Oh. 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 Oh my god! What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> we were hitting it so hard! Okay, I'm gonna clean up and Carson's gonna make them. It got everywhere! Look at this! God. Hold still for a second. I'm gonna get the remnants. It's literally on my face. So what do you want to do? Tim or do you want to just put we it on just, here? We can just put it on there. Okay. Like, oh my god, y'all saw that in the flesh. <laughs> like, in the flesh. You should, you should make that in slow-mo. Oh. Oh. oh my god, guys. Mm. This is so ugly. Like, what the heck? <laughs> anyway, we're going to take a hiatus. We'll show you guys what happens when <laughs> they're ready. Those look luxurious. Do you think they should go for a little bit longer? No, they're ready. No, wait. Let me see the middle. Yeah. No, oh, they're, ready. they're ready. They're ready. Yeah. Woohoo! Yay! <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna watch a David Dobrik vlog that just came out. What Ooh, is my hair? I'm yes. Gonna watch <laughs> She's gonna watch it with me too. We just watched the season finale of The Bachelor, and it was just. <sighs> I think it was kind of expected. It, it, it was okay, but I'm glad that it ended and like I'm officially done with it. So yeah. <coughs> Why? Oh god, I've been chugging water all morning. We're not getting corona. Okay, I just had like a sneezing fest, like it just went crazy. But anyway, I'm about to get ready for my call back today. It's at two. I'm glad it's only dance. Hopefully they don't ask me to sing again because literally something's going on i'm going to get ready real quick and then i should be ready to head out by one o'clock and yeah i had spinach and eggs for breakfast my makeup's done i'm about to head out it's definitely 101 i just need to change pants okay guys so today they've got a hand is that so cool like they're that's huge like do you see how it's like all outlined like yeah, you can okay. tell what it's gonna look like what's well, an apple painting so guys sad story but true tea i got cut it was the fourth round I got cut, so there you go. I got some yogurt pretzels as my celebration reward. And I'm going home to edit a video for you guys. Guys, Carson just made her first Postmate experience. <laughs> surprise, surprise, it's Shake Shack again. It's Shake Shack. Sadly. Just in love with it. The there you time, go. So. Now I got my Postmates. Mine is from I just feel like it's a ramen. Yum. My meal. All right guys, it is currently 9.25 and honestly, I didn't want to work out. I didn't want to move, but I realized I wasn't getting anything done anyways. And I feel like, I don't know, I feel like energizing myself a little bit just so that I can focus later. That makes no sense, but basically I'm going to work out because I feel bad if I'm going to skip a day again and I already had a rest day, you know, that's what I'm saying. Even though I had a call back today and was moving and dancing and stuff, I feel like I should still work out and move. Oh 
Hey guys, so for the rest of the night, I'm going to be watching a movie and hopefully editing a YouTube video. We love to sit. Good morning guys, it's Thursday and honestly, Carson and I are just going to live our best lives. I feel like this coronavirus thing, yes, it's crazy, yes, it's getting worse. We are very well aware and we're in New York City and that's like one of the most populated places to be, especially like Subway and like just the people you come into contact with and just all the things, but like we're gonna live our best lives and go get some bagels. I I, yes, and it's gonna be amazing. Like I had an audition this morning, I just did not go. I just did not feel like going. There were two okay. and I was like, you know what? It's okay. Yeah, coronavirus is getting literally insane. Like, we were just talking this morning, and it's like, we really can't believe something like this is kind of happening right now, like, in our time of life. <laughs> so, it's just, everything's just kind of crazy, but, like, It feels just, like a movie. It's so Yeah, weird. it feels like a literal movie. Like, it's like, you don't think it's, you know, like, it's never something that you would think that would happen yeah. to you or in your neighborhood or, like, whatever, but, like, it's a real thing and it's kind of scary. So, yeah, with that being said, we're gonna get some bagels. We're gonna go, we're gonna <laughs> so, we're gonna go out on the subway. bagels we're heading home i think we're gonna stop at the grocery store on the way back and yeah we don't look the best right now but it's okay okay guys mazani left me a package so i'm gonna go ahead and unbox it yay Aww. more stuff so excited to be using this stuff because i asked them if they could send me specific things i got more of this stuff which i use all the time got more of this that i also use all the time carson at this point this is your bottle because like i'm serious i have so many of those excited to use this this is the new thing that they were talking about and then scalp care this is what i really need like that's why i asked them to send this to me for scalp purposes thank you thank you again mizani this stuff is freaking great ah and shut you love a dinner moment yay Okay, Carson did her makeup. She looks amazing. <laughs> and we're watching the bold type. Yay. So guys, Carson is taking Instagram pictures, but I'm going to be making us dessert. I don't know. This whole ugh, this whole coronavirus thing is honestly insane and it's causing people to literally lose their minds. Awful kind of update, guys. It kind of sucks. Corona's getting even worse and life's kind of sucking at the moment. I don't know. I don't know how I feel. Things are just getting out of hand and kind of crazy. All the news articles, all the craziness. Like, it doesn't even feel right, you know? Yeah, Carson might even be leaving, like, back to North Carolina. Like, I can't physically do that right now, but, like, and I'd be fine up here, but, like, it's just kind of crazy. I'm, I have no idea what to do. But, like, this is a real thing. Like, it's kind of scary. The this, is me. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Oh my god. That's the difference. That's a no. I just want to hermit crab myself forever. I literally might be leaving today. I'm literally, I'm like freaking out. Like I'm like laughing. There's one at 620. Oh my god. Saturday. Hey guys, so I know I have my retainer in. I wanted to let you guys know that now things are just getting super, super serious and I actually might be going home to Charlotte because of how crazy this is getting. Uh, I think I'm 80% sure that I might be going home. There is that small percent that I might stay, but chances look like my parents are going to actually drive up here and pick me up. I don't know. I, wanna, I don't want to be down anymore tonight. It re really just sucks. It's already like 2 in the morning. Yes, I have gloves on. So yeah, I love you guys. I will see you guys tomorrow. Hopefully I'm in a better mood. It's just, it's dampening. Everything's dampening here right now. Good morning, guys. It is Friday the 13th. Um, how lovely. 
Carson's going back home officially, as I said last night. It's the morning time right now. She just went out to go get some coffee for both her and I, and I'm making breakfast. Here's the situation. Coronavirus is actually getting really, really bad up here, and we're paying rent for this place slash Airbnb that like I've been staying in for the time being, and I think it's just, and like it's true, it's just gonna be way too expensive to stay up here for a month and really not be able to do anything. I think situations and events looks like it's leaning more towards the fact that I won't even be able to do anything while I'm up here for a month so my family wants me to come home oh my god that's the last thing that I even thought would occur like going back home to Charlotte I just my brain can't wrap around the fact that like I'm leaving and I think I'm leaving tomorrow I'm not flying my parents are going to drive up here for it's gonna be a 10-hour drive for them to come here pick me up I just have too many things and my dad when he went back last he took my suitcase he took his suitcase just because I mean like we assumed I was gonna be up here so and that was literally a week and a half ago so he has my suitcases meaning I don't even have suitcases or boxes or any kind of moving equipment to do this on my own so they are driving up here and yes my sister might be staying back home in charlotte just because i don't know if she wants to take this freaking drive but yeah it sucks this literally is the worst thing that could have happened the fact that like i just started calling this my home and making this like my place now it's going to not be my place anymore and i'm going to probably be in a whole different apartment by the time i come back we're going to have more moving vlogs in the future <laughs> so yeah so i'm just trying to keep a positive mindset i'm watching the bold type it's a great show i'm watching it catching up on it for the time being that's all i can do and just chill out and not take things too seriously but at the same time be precautious about my health and about my wellness and about my family's wellness and i know that they're gonna want me to be home as well so so yeah this honestly just kind of sucks it really does so i'm not in the best mood like i'm not gonna sugarcoat it i'm not in the best mood but yeah that's how my day's going if you guys were wondering but yes it is currently 11 something i think so we've got the whole day ahead of us can we believe that this is happening no is it happening yes and very very fast and rapidly so that's the update for you guys i've currently got some spanako pita in the oven which is my favorite thing they're awesome little thingy things i'm just trying to give myself all the comfort food and love food that i like so that i feel good you know i'm literally about to cry this sucks all right guys update for this vlog i think i'm gonna end this vlog here because i'm just gonna start a new one because i think this whole video is just going to take a turn anyway so this is like my last like clip for this video i'm just gonna end it here but the next video will be super enjoyable because we're gonna do something really fun and cool today you know and i just kind of want to take you guys on that journey but i want to try and vlog as much as possible before i actually leave tomorrow like it's actually happening it's a thing so carson's gonna say bye too <laughs> so yes we're goodbye, ending the vlog. vlog here don't think you're gonna see the last of us you will see us in the next vlog and it'll be even more fun so exactly. yes <laughs> goodbye vlog yeah. thank you guys for watching and i will see you guys in a future video bye, bye.